Today I'd like to try some different ways to pluck the strings. Firstly, we're going to look at alternate picking. This is when we pluck the strings both up and down with our plectrum or pick. This will enable you to play a lot faster and with more control. Let's try this on one note to start with. Fret the bottom string at the 3rd fret or note of G. Then use your pick to pluck the string down, then up, like this. Down, up, down, up, down, up, and so on. Try doing this slowly to begin with, then at a faster speed or tempo. As you become better at this, you will find that you can then play what is called tremolo picking, like this. When you feel comfortable with this, we will move on to using it with the scale. Let's try it with G major. As we play the notes of the scale, we pluck them using down, then up strokes alternately. Down on the G, up on the A, down on the B, up on the C, down on the D, up on the E, down on the F sharp, and finally up on the G. Please do this slowly to begin with and try to be as accurate as possible. Secondly, let's try some simple finger style plucking. In other words, using only the thumb and first finger of your plucking hand. A little trick I use while doing this is to hold my plectrum in my middle finger like so. This means that I can have it ready if I want to move between the two styles of plucking. For this exercise, we will just use the open top E string. Start by plucking the string with your thumb, then your first finger like this. Repeat again and again, and as before, try doing this at various speeds until you are confident with this. The third technique we will try is called hybrid picking. As the name suggests, it uses a combination of plectrum and fingers. Let's try a simple exercise to start with. For this we will use the top two strings, both played open. Hold your pick as normal and pluck the B string. Then use your middle finger to pluck the top E string. Go between the two, like so. Pick, finger, pick, finger, pick, finger, and so on. Once again, please practice this until you can do it easily and at different speeds. Now I will show you an exercise to improve all three plucking techniques that we have tried. For this, we will use just one chord, E major. Place your fretting hand on this chord and hold it. First we will use alternate picking. Pick downwards on the fourth string, then up on the top E string then down on the 3rd string, and up on the E string. Lastly, pick down on the B string, and up on the E. Please do this slowly to begin with, and make sure you can hear each note clearly. Repeat this over and over again, until you are confident and can play at various speeds. Now let's try the same exercise with finger style playing. This time we pluck the fourth string with our thumb, then top E with our first finger. Then thumb on the third string, and E with our first finger. And lastly, the second string with thumb, and E with finger. Once again, please do this slowly to begin with, and make sure you can hear each note clearly, then build up your speed. The last technique we will use for this exercise is hybrid picking. This time we pluck the fourth string with our pick, then top E string with our middle finger, then pick on the third string and E with our finger, and lastly the second string with pick and top E with finger. Repeat again and again until you do this with confidence. As I hope you'll notice, 
Not only will you build up your speed with these different ways of plucking, but you'll hear that you can achieve different tones and volumes or dynamics by switching between them. Practice, practice, practice. Bye for now.